Yeah, normally you guys all saw I'm wearing the whole black attire right now. I was trying to blend in with the background, kind of. <laughs> Actually, I'll tell you guys the truth. Normally, when I perform, I always wear Hawaiian shirts. That's my thing. I love wearing Hawaiian shirts. And people ask, why do you wear Hawaiian shirts? Are you Hawaiian? I'm like, no. <laughs> like, well, why do you wear them, cabron? Because they fit. <laughs> I'm serious, man, because you guys know when you're fluffy, fashion is secondary. It is, man. <laughs> And I say fluffy, that's the politically correct term. For those of you that don't know, there's actually five different levels of fatness. If you don't know them, let me tell them. There's big, there's healthy, there's husky, there's fluffy, and there's damn. If you walk into a bar or restaurant and the waiter or waitress looks at you and goes, damn, who you need to go. Here's another clue to find out if you've gone too far. Let's say you get hungry, two, three o'clock in the morning, you want some munchies or some snacks. So you walk into a convenience store, no big deal. <laughs> ding, ding. What's up, man? How much are the Twinkies? 50 cents, okay, I'll take two, okay, I'll see you later, bye. <laughs> ding, ding. That's cool. But if you show up at two, three o'clock in the morning and it's a little more like this, <laughs> ding. Go home. <laughs> You've gone too far. It's cool being fluffy though. My ex-girlfriend, she was cool. She was fluffy too. She was, man. I used to call her up in the middle of the night and all my friends would always tell us how romantic we were. I'd call her up, no big deal, right? <laughs> Old school, huh? up the phone. Hello. Hey. What are you doing? Oh, nothing. I'm just here. Ooh. Where? In the kitchen. Oh, really? Ooh, what are you doing in the kitchen? Oh, nothing. I'm just baking. Oh, really? Oh, my God. What are you baking? Oh, nothing. Just a chocolate cake. Oh, really? Oh, baby, say it slow, say it slow. Chocolate cake. Ay, Dios mío. Oh, baby. Ooh. I can't take it anymore. I'm going to come. You're going to come. I'm going to come over and eat your cake. I miss her. <laughs> cake, man. I miss the cake. I'm a big old cake freak, man. I'm, I'm always at bakeries or panaderias, you know. And see, I say panaderias. Panaderias, for those of you who don't speak Spanish, it's a basically a Mexican bakery with attitude. <laughs> like, you don't get donuts at a panaderia. You get pan dulce. And again, pan dulce is like a Danish to the 10th power. The only thing that sucks for me is every time I show up to a panaderia, there's always like a little old lady upset with one of the bakers because for whatever reason they ran out of something. You know the lady, right? She's always, Keke, what do you mean you don't have no more birotes? <laughs> How come you don't have no more birotes? <laughs> I talked to Carlos yesterday. He said today, seven o'clock, you're going to have birotes. Mira, cabrón, porque chingados no tienen birotes. And then I walk in. Ah, pues con razón. Si pinche Pikachu se los chingó.
Yeah, the whole thing, man. People ask, like I said, about the whole Hawaiian shirt thing, and I wear them. And I, I gotta tell you guys, because I wear them because I live here in Los Angeles, man. And you guys know about the color thing. You can't wear the wrong color, because if you wear the wrong color, they think you're in a gang. Like if you wear all blue, people say, it's a crib. If you wear red, it's a blood. I mess around and wear yellow. It's a Pokemon. <laughs> I'm in line for a roller coaster at Disneyland. Little kids are like, Abba, it's Pikachu. <laughs> I haven't been able to shake it since. <laughs> you know, all the names and stuff. I'm hanging out with my mom. She asked me, ¿Por qué te dicen Pikachu? ¿Qué se pasa? Pikachu. Are they sneezing or what? Pikachu. 